So, let us continue. Here we are at the Magician's Study. We'll just exit and get the Yellow Trinity. That, when I ended the last video, I remembered, like, instantly. Alright. Let's get this thing. Ah! Yeah, I haven't played in a while, so... I feel like I don't know how to jump. Okay, now we go. Power up! Perfect. So I really need this. So, there's something else here, right at a distance. May look easy to get. Oh, I jumped too high. But as you can see, you can't see where to land. And if you fall in the water, you have to go all the way back and try again. That's the big problem I have with this thing. It's just that you can't jump in the water, and that's what makes it worse. Oh, and for those who don't know, there's always gonna be like a chicken in background or something. In my last house it was tr it was trucks, and now it's chickens. So, and no, I don't have a farm. So just 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 deal with it. Just, just <laughs> all right. More Dalmatians. I wonder how many of those I got. Huh, I'm almost... Well, not almost, but kind of there. And I got all the yellow ones, just need one wet one, and two blues, and one green. I think you get all of those in the last level that I'm going right now. I think so. I mean, not the last level, just the next level. <laughs> I just call it the last level because it kind of looks like it, but it's really not. So, yeah. Uh, but before that, I'm going to go here because there's something else you can get here. Okay. Let's go to Queen's Castle. I think there are more than one thing in here that to get. Uh, so now that we have the, ju the high jump, we can reach this place. Get this. More Dalmatians. Uh, what else was here? We gotta go through. Let me check this room one second. I know that there's something in this room that. Um, I don't know, I just remember that there's just something else. It doesn't seem like I've done everything in this room. I just feel like there was something about that teddy bear up there, and this book here. There was just something here, but I really can't recall exactly what it was. I don't know if you do it when you're big or when you're small. I just have no clue. Maybe you, you glide there or something. Anyway, I think I'm gonna try that like later in the game, uh, off screen. And if I find something, I'll just show you guys. So I don't want to be like running around looking for stuff. But there are still some things to get, because there were some areas that I can reach before, and now I can. I think I 
is right here. Oh, get out of the way. Man, these guys just one hit and they're like almost dead. That's the difference of strength. Uh, I guess I should go through here. I have a high jump, but not that high. <laughs> Clubba clubba clubba. Clubba clubba. More Dalmatians, sweet. The more I get, the better. <laughs> the sooner I can get that done. like there's something there. Ah! Can I get up there from here? Oh man. I just need to be a little higher. The chair looks pretty high. Come on. Help me. Oh, come on. I can't get on this chair. Wow. I'll be back. Alright, so we're back. Let's try that again. Please land in there. Oh. Aw oh, man, stupid gummy piece. Alright, so here we are. And hello. I don't think there's anything else. At least that I can remember. I mean, maybe on Monstro you can find some stuff, but I'm just gonna go to the new world. And later on, when I'm finished with this world, I'm gonna go back and try and find everything. Uh, but I just wanna make sure that the next world uh, probably has all the stuff that I need. Maybe. This is really a lot of stuff to get here. So you can see there were like a bunch of stars there. <laughs> you might think that you're not powerful enough. Well, you kind of are, but don't underestimate the monsters there. They're pretty strong. But you can pretty much fend yourself. You, you, you're, you know. They're not overpowered. There are a few uh, upgrades that I can get later for the ship when I um, like at some point of the game. I can't recall what exactly was that I did. Uh, they pretty much give you every Gumi there is, and you can upgrade your ship even further. Because <clears throat> right now I'm not at the maximum, you know, the, there's some pretty neat stuff you can get, like a shield that pretty much protects you from damage, and uh, you can take a lot of hits along the way. Right now, if I only take a few hits, they'll just take me down. But due to my firepower, it takes a lot from them to try and get to me. There we go, we got there pretty fast. So here it is, Hello Bastion. It's one of my favorite levels of the whole Kingdom Hearts saga. Or 
torch. Look at that. I know this place. Hollow Bastion. It's really awesome. Hmm, that's strange. I wonder why. I feel this warmth inside, right here. Oh, you're just hungry. Well, I am. <laughs> hey, I'm serious! Let's go. So, uh, a note is that the music on this level sounds similar, or I don't know if it's the rhythm, the style, but it sounds so similar to the first level of Turok 2. For those who have played Turok 2, uh, should know that there's some sort of like similarities with the rhythm and all that. That's that's all. Well, that's what it always reminds me of is Turok. <laughs> so, if you want to go and, and check it out and just go check out the game, you'll see what I mean. In Turok, it's pretty hard. I've only finished the game by cheating on it. <laughs> there we go, more Dalmatians. That is awesome. So these two bubbles are useless, we just gotta keep going up and trying different bubbles. It, I think that this place just has like a problem with gravity. That's why it's so, everything's floating, the water's going up, you can walk on water. Uh, you know, it's just weird like that. And the reason I call this place the last level before, it's just got how it looks and how it feels. It just seems like the last level. <laughs> I mean, I know it's a little bit of a spoiler to say that it's not, but... You know, it really is, and it's almost the last level, but, you know, we're not quite there yet. Let's try and reach this thing. Zaga ring. Let's try this bubble. That ring is all, it's just like the Protego ring, but with an elemental resistance to, to ice. That's pretty much all there is to it. Ah, oh, we gotta go up again. But I just want to make sure that I get everything, so I don't want to be missing Dalmatians or stuff like that. Oh, I want to make it on time. Ah, oh, I didn't make it on time. <laughs> Here we go. So let's go higher and see if we're missing. Oh, there's that scene here. No vessel. No help from the Heartless. So tell me, how'd you get here? Hmm. Uh, I simply believed. Nothing more to it. When our world fell into darkness, Belle was taken from me. I vowed I would find her again, no matter what the cost. I believed I would find her. So here I am. She must be here. I will have her back! Take her if you can. Finally made it. About time. I've been waiting for you. We've always been rivals, haven't we? 
You've always pushed me, as I've always pushed you. Riku! But it all ends here. There can't be two Keyblade Masters. What are you talking about? Let the Keyblade choose. It's true master! Maleficent was right. You don't have what it takes to save Kyrie. It's up to me. Only the Keyblade Master can open the secret door and change the world. But that's impossible. How did this happen? I'm the one who fought my way here with the Keyblade. You were just the delivery boy. Sorry, your part's over now. Here, go play hero with this. Hey, don't move! You're hurt! Why... Why did you... You come here? I came... To fight for Bell. And though I am on my own, I will fight! I won't leave without her. That's why I'm here. Me too. I'm not going to give up now. I came here to find someone very important to me. So, we don't have a choice. <laughs> and we totally need him. So this is the Beast from Beauty and the Beast. I don't know much about the Disney movie, but I've already seen, like, uh, read books about it and seen other animations about it, so I'm pretty sure everyone has seen something about the Beauty and the Beast at some point of their lives. Or else you didn't have a childhood. <laughs> but the Disney movie specifically, this this version of the Beauty and the Beast, I really haven't seen it. Uh, maybe I will someday just for, you know, knowing about it more. But it's really not related that much to this game, because this, uh, this is not his world. Um, but we'll be hearing more about it in future Kingdom Hearts games, and that's where I'll probably give you guys a more detailed explanation about it. By then, I, I should already have seen the movie. So we don't have the Keyblade, so fighting is not an option. He's the only one that can fight for you. You can use magic still. But your sword doesn't work on the Heartless. I mean, it does hurt. I think it hurts them, but it's such a little difference. Maybe you hit them like 1 HP per hit. <laughs> that's, how, that's how stupid this sword is. Like, I don't see the reason why the game bother on giving it to you, so... I don't know. It's like a humiliation. <laughs> but they'll explain later on why he lost the Keyblade. At least Riku didn't get the... the upgraded version. He got the first Keyblade, so he sucks. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, I should have taken those guys out. Now I won't be able to open this stuff. See if I can kill them from here. Those are the most annoying monsters in this area. Those bubble dark things. Or maybe I I, I maybe I spoke too soon. Maybe there are more annoying than those. Maybe. But those are just one of the top ones. More mithril. What does this do? Well, it resets the square just in case you messed up. I know there's like another switch out there that triggers the other platform. Um, but I don't think I need to activate that thing. Because I can always just get there. I mean, look at this thing here. So why why do we need the other one? I mean, you can just reach it like this. <laughs> and no one will get at this point of the game without Glide. So what's the big deal? I don't know. It's retorted! So let's see what's in here. I'm stuck on the wall. Uh, so we don't just need Beast to defend ourselves. We need him to break these things. And we are best to find all of them before we enter the castle. Because otherwise you will have to be forced to change party members just to get some stuff. Now let's use the bubble to go in the other way. I mean, I know this place doesn't make much sense, but does the whole game make any sense? <laughs> It doesn't make sense, so why bother? Faraga ring. Same thing, only with fire. He's so strong, how did he lose to Riku? I don't get it. Riku should have been in pieces back there. One thing I know about the Beauty and the Beast is that the witch or whoever cast this curse on him turned him into a monster. Basically all that she did was transform him and everybody who lived in his castle into what they were like inside, like a reflection of what they were inside. And since he was a douche, then he turned into a beast. Because he was like really mean and angry all the time, so. And Bell kind of became his, uh. I don't know, like, he started to change when he met her. And everybody else in the castle turned into candles or candlestick or tea teapots because <laughs> they were his servants so you know that's kind of what they represent alrighty whoa ow there we go this should open the gate, I think. There we go. So now the, the front door is open, we can go in, but... I'm gonna... I'm gonna go to the safe spot and... and 
continue next time. So we just go back the same way. We don't have to activate all the switches, but at least enough to get out. It's kind of funny how he gets stuck there. <laughs> it's like, I can't, oh, I'm, too, I'm too stupid. So that's, that's really all we have to activate. There's maybe more in here, I don't know. Maybe. But... Oh, darn it, I saw something, yeah. I gotta go back. Oh, where's the bubble? Where's the bubble? Yeah, I knew there was like something missing. Another wall to break. Oh, it's another zone. Whoa. Hit you with my sword. <laughs> Just not doing any damage. There's a blue trinity here. Can't carry that. Can't carry that either. So here it is. For next time, I'll be back here. Um. I know this platform goes up, but it's not doing anything, so... Maybe it'll, it doesn't activate now, it activates later. I don't know. There's always going to be time to explore this place, but for now, I'm just going to stop here, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.